Now, you know what? I don't understand gangs. I really don't. I do not understand gangs. Now, I, when I was 13, I was in the crew. It, it was technically a gang, but, you know, it was a crew. It was not as severe uh, uh, as these gangs, modern-day gangs, but I would call it a crew. It was, it was the same mentality. Uh, we had the same mentality that the, that the gangs have. Um, we were just a bunch of losers wreaking havoc. We were immature. We were stupid. And you know what? It's the same mentality that the mentality that the modern day gangs have. Immaturity, stupid, academically, losers. I mean, it's the exact same thing, except now the gangs are more concentrated. But all we did was wreak havoc and gossip. Then we got into a big fight and all of us separated. And you know what? I haven't seen some of them in 30 years. And you know what? That's a good thing. And you know what? My mother did something interesting. She moved across town to another school district, etc. So when I was 14, I vowed to myself I would never be part of a crew, a gang, ever again. And I have kept that vow, that vow, over 40 years. 40, 42 years to be exact. No, 45 years. I have kept that vow to myself to never be part of a crew or group, or gang again. I have kept that vow to myself. I decide to be an eagle and not a chicken. I decide to fly alone. And when I moved to that new school district, everything improved. My, ac my academics improved. More challenging classes, everything improved. And you know what, I think that's a solution for a lot of the gang, the problem with gangs, is to separate. They need to go, I mean, the United States is very big. <laughs> go to another state. I think that is the solution for the gangs is to break up. Because, look, they think they can stand each other. But, look, we couldn't even stand each other. When we were in the gang, hardly any of us, there's only two of us that were actually friends. The rest of us couldn't stand each other. And I submit to you that when people are in gangs, hardly any of them can even stand each other. I mean, I, I submit to you that there is no real friendship there. They can't stand each other. There's no real friendship. Because there was no real, real friendship in our gang. There's only two of us that were actually even friends. And we fought. Okay. We were just a bunch of losers. But I think that is the answer to the gangs. That they need to separate. So they can grow up. Because you know what? After the separation, we all grew up. It forced us to grow up. If Because, look, we were just all a bunch of 13, 14-year-old losers. And once we separated, we were forced to grow up. Best thing that ever happened to us. Best thing that ever happened to me. Was to leave, the, leave that group and never see them again. I haven't seen a lot of them for 30 years. Hopefully I'll never see them again, ever. <laughs> Have a nice day.